Before the Bing Bang, there was another universe, called Mera. Mera had very different laws of physics that we know today, and elements not present on our periodic table. Mystic elements with powerful abilities, and yet, unable to create life. Mera was filled with energy and matter, and mindless celestial bodies, known as Titans. Cronus was the biggest Titan of all, and was getting bigger by consuming everything on his way, threatening Mera with a devastating end. Before the danger of the complete emptiness, everywhere and forever, some of the Mera enchanted elements, helped Mera to grow emotional. The fear Mera felt, made her strong enough to push Cronus to the very edge of her. Ironically, with the exodus of Cronus from Mera's cosmic balance, Mera caused her own destruction, because the Titan underwent to a massive reaction and expansion, replacing Mera with a newborn universe. However, somewhere beyond the boundaries of our today's universe, there is still a small part of Mera left, that survived the Bing Bang. That was where me was born. During the initial singularity, carbon and hydrogen escaped the gravitation of the human universe, and entered Mera's time and space. Those human elements together with Mera's unique matter, created the certain conditions for the origins of Mi's life. Mi, wasn't always as you know her, but she was evolved through millions of years. Due to the nature of her creation, Mi has both Mera and human abilities, and she can exist in both universes, even at the same time. Mi, travels alone on the top of an asteroid's grid, she controls with her superpowers, and she built a radar searching for intelligent life. She received signals from Earth satellites, and her curiosity was unimaginable when she found out the same symbol she had on her face in our planet. So she's coming! And so, that was Mi's origins. But nobody knows her real intentions. What if she's pissed with plasma, and she unleashes one of her asteroids and kill everyone on planet? A super villain me? Maybe?